It's, we was just talking by message because I was waiting to get in the kitchen. It's an half gone warm. It's an half gone warm, isn't it, Vincent? Yeah, it's, it's hot and it's really, really muggy. Muggy, like that's the word. I'm still, there's a window open just there with a nice breeze coming in. Oh, yeah, I've got a window there. Yeah, I can't bang. And it, there's, <laughs> there's the breeze right there and there's the other breeze coming from that window. Right, anyway, let's get on to this. Do you want, do you want, to, do you want to start this or do you, what do you want? Well, it, it's just basically because of we, we've done the um, the free new Cadbury's chocolate we reviews. We, Val did it yesterday. Well, that's me praying all that. It's, it's always a week. There's no lying in tea. That's, that's true. Um, we, because we've done that and we was talking via message about the fact that the, the flavours were not particularly original. Right, yeah, well, let's just quickly delve over this because obviously we won't give no spoilers away because Val's reviews there. Check out his free videos. Oh, but I was speaking to the boy about this. They're not that inspiring, are they? If you've been given the choice no. to chance by Cadbury, you're going to think, I want to do something a little different. Yeah, and they've said they opened it up to the public and said, send us in what flavour chocolate you'd like to have. And I think, especially like coconut and the honeycomb, that's not particularly original. And let's be honest, blueberry, it's just going to be a fruit. It's just a fruit and nut without the nuts. Yeah, almost like so a raisin. It, it, what, they say it's come from the public. I think the public are members of their own staff at the Cadbury factory. Or do you re- or, it yeah, it, right, it's either that, it's either a bit of dodge gone on, or do you reckon Cadbury's have had 200 of these, 2,000 of these come in? Or, I didn't see it advertised, did you? But say they had, no. te- say they had 10,000 ideas come in, do you reckon they've yeah. almost picked three of the easiest to do? Yeah, obviously there's a science to the making of the chocolate and what can stay fresh on the, the, the supermarket shelves and things like that. Of course. There's got to be some science to it, why they've had to pick them particular ones. I just, I'm just i sure that in them 10,000, 20,000, however many people sent ideas in, surely there was something a bit more exciting than honey. Yeah. Let's be honest, whether we had toffee in it or not is beside the point. Even toffee, realistically, the- it's, it's not... Obviously, it's not grabbing you by the balls, is it? Let's be frank no, about it. No, it ain't. It's not grabbing any testicles at all. <laughs> <laughs> right, so so what we decided to do, and and we're, we're, we're plotting, he's dabbing his head because, yeah, we're plotting this to Cadbury's. This, this, this video we are sending to Cadbury. They can watch this. Hopefully they will see it. We are plotting our ideas. So we've got, we got, how many ideas did you have? Was it one in the end? I've got one, one and a half. He's got one and a half. I've got pure one, but I've got a twist on mine that you don't know about. I've got one. Oh, cool. And, and, and we start. Do you want to start or do you want me to start? No, you start because I think your one is a, a winner, winner. My, I think my it's one. It's much more original than mine. Yeah, I think my one's a winner. Um, I've just literally chosen crisp in chocolate. It sounds boring and simple, but I don't think it's been done yet. Just a chocolate bar with crisps in it. And we spoke about this. You could pick any flavour, Chris, but I think to keep it realistic and a, and a more plainer taste on it, you have to have really sorted. I think. Yeah, one hundred percent. And I think and I think it would work because, as we, as we said in our discussion the other day when we was planning this video, we we said that people like Chris and chocolate. I think I said about my sister always has. There you go. He's made one. I made one. That's the <laughs> twist. You can check out this video tomorrow. But I literally made the crisp and chocolate. Look at that. The you said you was going to make it. It's melting down a bar of chocolate, put some crisps in it. And the thing is, when you watch them make any chocolate recipe on the... As we know, Jamie Oliver especially always puts a pinch of salt in any chocolate that he's melting down. So ready... Because it does something to the flavour. So a ready salted crisp inside a chocolate bar has got to be spot on. It's, it's, it's literally in every box. It is. Uh, sorry if there's a bit of lag. I've just noticed there's a little bit of lag when Val's talking, but that's what happens with these live calls. Um, yeah. It, well, that's because even, even the camera's got bored of me talking. No, it's just like lagging. You're talking, it's like... Like an old Bruce Lee film. Sorry. So it's, he's apologised. It's not his fault. <laughs> it's, it's my poxy... You know, I'll tell you what, Virgin Media, me and you are having work to do. Yeah, it works. And I have, I have tasted it. It, it works, it's, it was simple to do, it would be a cheap chocolate bar to, to make, but check that video out tomorrow if you want to see that. What's your idea? Yeah, my, mine was, so mine was apple crumble, um, which again isn't, all right, it's not like, you're not doing cartwheels about right, stop, it. Stop one second, oh, no. right, stop one second, I'm just going to end this and yeah. call you back, see if it's a bit better. All right, mate. Well, I'm just going to call him back because it was lagging a bit, but if it's lagging, it's lagging, there's not much we can do about it. 
This is my answer in phone face. He's not answering. They're really bad. It's just lagging a bit. I can hear you. No, now he's gone. Oh. Talk. It's the cloud. It says poor connection, video paused. No, you ain't paused to me. That's what just come up. Well, I ain't moved done. I have not moved. I've got oh, it's epoxy internet. You're, you're moving perfectly to me. It's all in sync. It's my internet then, isn't it? Right, talk. I look crystal clear in my little screen in the top corner. Yeah, so... And you look fine, and it's coming out fine. Right, so, right, on the finished video, it might be a bit... Loud. You just have to take it. What's your idea, Vincent? Yeah, so, it was Apple Crumble, which you get, like I said, it's not going to make you do carpools, like their choices, eh? However, I know, you remember the boxes of chocolate? Can you still get boxes of chocolates, like milk tray and dairy? Yeah, I think, yeah, dairy just about, but you get about, you get about two chocolate in the box. Yeah, that's it, uh, for ages. I had them a few years ago, uh, an apple flavour. It was a milk tray. They bought out like an apple. Yes, they did. Chocolate. I remember right, so that. The apple flavour's the apple flavour's there. It's like flour, a butter, and sugar, right? Now and butter inside a chocolate bar because I don't think it'll keep. But just break up some shortbread biscuits. We'll act as the crumble with the apple flavouring to give it an apple crumble type taste. Look, I think Val's one is better than mine in taste-wise. I would buy Val's in the shop over mine. I think mine's simpler to make, but if you get that apple crumble right with the apple, oh, it's a winner. It's, it's the best one I've ever heard of. You can do it with, with rhubarb crumble and gooseberry crumble. And, of course uh, you could. Crumble. You can do it. The, the fruit possibility is endless. You, whatever you put in a crumble, surely you could whack into a chocolate bar. Oh, it's, it's, it's chocolate bar with a lot of fruit. Of course it does. Right, it's, it's the, you could do the full range. So you're more talking apple. How would you do the apple again? That's what I've just, I don't think I heard that. Right, so I don't know what the science is, but in that milk tray, there's like an apple tasting little miniature chocolate thing. Yes. And it's got an apple flavour of apple in it. It's like little apple pieces. So you'd put apple pieces in, some shortbread biscuit, call it a crumble. No one's going to criticise you for calling it a crumble because a shortbread yeah. biscuit's basically got the ingredients of a crumble in it. Would you consider adding a, a little... A few sprinkles of vanilla to it, so you almost got that yeah. custody taste as well. Yeah, you, vanilla, cinnamon. You know, you can go yeah, down any cinnamon. Of spices. Not too much cinnamon because it gets overpowering. You just, just want it. Yeah, to, yeah, but you don't want a, a lot of vanilla. You want just a hint of so you've got that apple crumble. Listen, you know them fridge milkshakes, and they've got them. Uh, the I, I reviewed a Moo one as well. Some other brand of milkshake. They do like strawberries and clotted cream milkshakes. Yes. They do all these different. Like, yes. They do cookie crumble milkshakes. They can put it in a milkshake. Put it in a bar of chocolate. I, I, right. I, I, what's, what was the half? Was the half the rhubarb bit? It was along the milk. No, the, the, the rhubarb thing just come to me off the top of the air because ah. I was thinking, well, I've seen them do chocolate with so many different fruits on the telly, so it would work in a chocolate bar. But the half idea was because of the milkshake thing, it was donut. Could you do a donut bar of chocolate? Oh. You get chocolate donuts. You would have to but shape how would you it. Get the donut, how would you get the donut pieces into the chocolate bar? So the flavour you could get, but the flavour. You... Yeah, because it's like, it's just dough, isn't it? You might, you might be able to. I don't know. Like we don't know the science of all this chocolate. Surely you can. Yes, exactly. there's some way of doing it. But you'd have this almost. You would want the chocolate bar to be round as well, no? Oh, what? Because it's a <laughs> yeah. And you probably could sprinkle it with some sort of sugar. Yeah, you'd call it a chocolate. <laughs> like the cross nut. <laughs> Well, I've, I think, yeah, I think Cadbury's are missing a trick if they ain't signing us up. All we want is them just to be called Inspired by Adam and Val or something along them lines. We don't even want cash. I do. I want about 20 grand at least. Right. You know? I've said that wrong, Cadbury. Uh, we, we do want a slight payment for our <laughs> travel expenses. <laughs> I ain't doing it for free. Travel expenses. Oh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> 20 grand, I'm going by jet. <laughs> <laughs> It's only up, up Birmingham or something, it's, it ain't far. Yeah, do they make the chocolate bar there, no? Yeah, in Cadbury World. You can have tours around Cadbury World. Yeah, but is that is that their factory? Or is that more just like a theme park? No, I think, no, I think it's their factory. You see oh, fair enough. Being made. Oh, fair enough. I, I went there once when I was a little tiny lid. Oh, no, I've, I've never been there. 
which is surprising, really. Yeah. I think if I went there, I'd never leave. You'd want to. We, we need to go there and do a full tour. <laughs> we'd probably get you offered one once they offer us the contract. Oh, we, we're there. All right, I'm going to end this. That's ten minutes. You want to say goodbye? I'm going to, and I'm going to sum this video up after. Okay, mate. See you later on. Bye, everyone. Thanks for watching. See you, done. Right, so just, I just want to stop this. Um, first of all, if there was a bit of lag in that there, we, are, we can only apologise. We're working with internet and Virgin have been messing me about for, for, for a little while now with their internet. Has anyone else got Virgin in it? Without swearing, it's shit at the moment. It's normally not bad, but it's just so unreliable at the moment. But anyway, there might have been a bit of lag, so I apologise for that. I will sum up the ideas. And you can see the video of my crisp and chocolate tomorrow i might be up tomorrow if i remember to pull it up but basically my idea was a, a, a walker's crisps teaming up with cadbury's ready sorted crisps in the chocolate we're done it's that simple my idea is a simple and it is a simple one but sometimes the simplest ideas are the best but personally i think val's idea was better if i was buying one if i was in a shop i'd probably pick them up both but if I had to pick up one, if they was both sitting there, I would pick Val's one. He's gone for the apple crumble chocolate. And he don't just want a plain chocolate bar and it say, they say to you, it's apple and crumble and it's got a little bit of apple and crumble essence in it. We don't want none of that. We want the full apple and crumble. So you've got shortbread on the top. You've got, a, he said like apple pieces inside the chocolate. And you could even add a little bit of linen to it, a little bit of cinnamon. So you've got that really nice apple and crumble taste. And he also said you could you could follow that up with a, a rhubarb and crumble, or you could do a, a gooseberry and crumble. You, the, the possibilities are, are kind of endless with the dessert range, but keep it simple. We don't want these bits of toffee, bits of nut, same old stuff you're recycling, a bit different and make it look different as well, the bar with that shortbread on top, etc. Crumbled up like shortbread on top. And then he also said he had like a half an idea, which was like a donut. It's, it's never been done. You could just make a round chocolate bar. Why don't you see round chocolate bars? A round chocolate bar with a hole in the middle. Donut flavour. We're not sure how they're going to work out the donut flavour, but donut flavour. And let's go. We're all buying it. But here we go. Thank you for watching this Adam and Val special. Just Walkers and Cadbury's and any other chocolate company. We'll take any chocolate company. If you want to um, get in contact, our fees are reasonable. We'll see you on the next video. You lot take care of yourselves.